What's good? Team exclusive and welcome back to, yes you've guessed it, I think day seven of foot freeze. Um, I know it's another one of these so we're just going to jump straight into it, kind of get get through things because I believe today is a severe player. Um, could be wrong, could be a, a day or so ahead of myself but I believe today is a severe player and really interested to see who's actually going to be because uh, I'd really like it to be maybe like a midfield Acuna. Um, Acuna, that could be quite cool. But who knows at this point? Who knows with, with EA and their position change? Of course, yesterday, if you didn't know, uh, video will be linked up in the eye and also at the end at the end of the video. Um, we did have Aaron Wambasaka. Very good, very good, very, very sweaty card as well. Very sweaty. Um, yeah, and very expensive as well. Very, very expensive. So you'd be kind of a fool if you did do it. But I mean, I can't really argue against it. Um, but yeah, let's see what we've got today. So... Who are we saying? Is it going to be cheap? Is it... Ooh, Jesus Navas. That centre-back. What is up with these right-back to centre-back position changes? He's... I don't know. It's just a bit dead. That's the problem. There's nothing away from the card that is probably quite good. Again, like I, I said this yesterday, Aaron Wambasaka looks really, really good, just like Joe Gomez, but it's just a bit dead, you know? Just a bit dead. But anyway, centre-back Jesus Navas, 86 rated. He is five foot eight, so yeah, I'm not sure about that one, Chief. Ain't sure about that one. If you're using a five foot eight centre back, you're you're a big fan of pain, big fan of pain, um, because he ain't going to be winning any headers. Four star skills though, so at least you can do skills with your centre back, which I suppose is good. Uh, two star weak foot, high medium, so he's not really going to play as a centre back. He's more going to just bomb rush up the field and probably play as your striker. But uh, yeah, okay, fair enough. Great pace, obviously, as you can tell. Great acceleration, good sprint speed, A3 pace in total. Shooting is not bad for a centre-back, obviously, uh, as he used to play right mid as well, so I suppose that's where that comes from, but uh, yeah, not terrible. Passing, it's okay. Dribbling, very nice. Defending, very nice. And physicals are actually quite okay, to be fair. For a 5 for 8 lad, he's uh, he's quite strengthy and he's got okay stamina, so... It, all in all, actually, is it's not a terrible card. It's just why would you want to use a five foot eight centre back? Like I'm five foot six, and you, I mean, I don't know. Like, I don't know. Two segments. Wow, of course. So what are we saying? If this is any more than, I'm gonna say. If this is more than any, what would I say for this? I mean, he's five foot eight. He's pretty unusable. Centre back, he's good. He's a good kind of meta centre back, but he's not tall, so it's really quite pointless. Um, I'm going to say an 82 and an 83. Now that might be quite stingy, but I think if you're paying more than that, you're kind of you're 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 robbing yourself. So we'll see. 83, 85. No, no way, no way. Have they just tried to charge you an 85 rated squad and a prime mixed players pack? Of course. And then 83 with a team of the week for um a gold a gold players pack. That's the same as Politano, isn't it? It is. Wow, that is crazy. He's like 150. So they, they're actually making you pay 150,000 coins for this piece of shit sent back. Like all EA have done is they've got the player and they've gone, oh, he's got 83 pace. Now he's got 85 defending, 80 physical, he's 150k. No, that's not how it works. He's 5 for 8. He's 5 for 8. Who's... No, I can't be bothered, man. It's ridiculous. It's actually ridiculous at this point. It really is. And... Uh, it's just sad. It's just sad. You know, like, Footmas, Christmas and all this kind of, kind of shit. Uh, I really did think EA was going to be like... Okay, we're going to give a little bit back to the community with, you know, I mean, objectives wise and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, that's cool. They've done quite a good job in, in that regard. Um, but in the SBCs, they're just missing the mark. Like, they're, they're charging people far too much for these somewhat pointless cards. They're going to be, they're going to be redundant by January. You know, when the next promo comes out and the next awesome centre back, you know, at the moment, we've got like Jimenez, Joe Gomez, Varane. Why are you going to use anybody? Why are you going to use Jesus Navas over those? That's the point. It's like, then why are you paying 150k for it? Because 
he's going to be redundant in like three weeks so it's, it's crazy just charge it like 50k let people have some fun yeah, he's five for eight but if he's 50k then it's a little bit more justified but now he's 150 it's, it's pointless anyway so there's another overpriced spc of the week uh he number seven that's not today's is it that was yesterday's surely okay so we got a rare gold pack which again is not great not great um what do you have to do so it's actually quite good to be fair no rating you get four golds two rare players from one club max three players from the same league maximum five nationality you can so you can use four golds and what seven seven bronzes which is quite nice and once again i'm going to go away complete this because everything else is trash in the game so god damn Okay, so there we go. There is my squad complete. Don't copy what I've done because I am an idiot. And uh, yeah, I just couldn't be bothered to, to find the necessary silvers and bronzes to, to actually get chemistry. Not that I actually had any bronzes, really. I, I made the mistake because I thought I had some bronzes and silvers, but I used them all up for, you know, the upgrade pack. So uh, this is what I had to do, unfortunately. But it is what it is. You know, we make stupid mistakes every day because that's who we are. Uh, I just don't really care, to be honest. But um, supposedly... That's pretty much it. We do have marquee matchups as well, which is quite nice. Obviously, you've got the loan. I wonder how much the loan is going to cost. Hopefully, not too much. Still players max minimum five. Liga Santander players one. 40 chemistry and you only need two, four, six. Six players in total. So, that's pretty cool. So, that's what they should be more like instead of like full gold squads. Not, not that it really matters, but I just think for loans, you shouldn't really be giving up a gold squad. Um, but... Either way, that's quite nice. So only only six players required, and um, you know majority of them have to be silver. I think you could, probably, you could do all of them silver. Actually, yeah, six silvers minimum five. So yeah, you're fine. It's good stuff to be fair. And like I say, I, I think I've mentioned this the you know the whole way through footmas or foot freeze is uh, you know it's a lot more beneficial to do the the loans because you'll probably be playing. Um, friendlies a lot more with the icon swaps coming out and that kind of stuff in there and they're going to come in very very handy especially for your first owner team so it's worth them um, it's worth doing them while they're in, i think that they're all there for about a week or so which is quite nice so even if the actual card expires you've still got time to uh, time to do that but uh, very cool very cool and of course still at the base icon upgrade pack which no one really cares about too much um was that a new league oh no it was mls Okay, so no, no, no new leagues. Do we have any new icons? Once again, no. It does seem like EA have kind of forgotten about the whole icon thing. Um, actually, before we do that, we're gonna have a quick look at the objectives because I didn't do this last uh, last night or yesterday. Um, and there is a few new objectives. Obviously, we've got the new silver stars. Oh, wow, that is one hell of a name. Um, Wham, Waman, Gituka, Waman, Waman Gituka. I think I nailed that. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, he's been requested for a long, long time. So it's good to see he's finally got a Silver Stars card. Very nice card at that as well. I believe he's Bundesliga. I believe he's Bundesliga. Unless he's uh, Bundesliga too, I'm not sure. But I, I'm pretty sure that's Bundesliga. Um, gets a link to Balassi as well. Nation link. Very, very nice. Great pace. I don't know what his exact stats are, but uh, very good looking card. Um, you know, for a silver, you can't you can't really argue with it. And obviously, it doesn't take much to get him. You'd have to win three games, which um, is pretty easy to do. Score eight, which is going to come naturally. And assist six, which is going to come nat nat naturally. You know, once you've scored eight, you're going to have assisted six, most likely. So, um, very easy stuff. And pretty much, that looks like it's about it, really, for objectives. Nothing actually new. Obviously, Silver Stars has been there for a, for a little, I think, a couple of days. So, there's no new objectives, which is interesting. Uh, and of course, in the milestones, we do have this uh, silver sensation, which has been there for a couple of days. You get a jumbo rare players pack for it for just doing a lot of silver objectives outside the box. Score three using silver players in 20, 20 separate matches for a two rare gold players pack. We've been over this. I don't see the point of doing it for two rare. I just don't I don't get that reward. Like, why a two rare players pack? Like, just give us like a, a small players pack or something. I, uh, EA is so tight, it's ridiculous. But yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy objective. And I don't really see who's going to be doing this. Win 200 matches with 11 silver players in your starting squad. Crazy. Play 200... Wait, 250? 
Scores 300 goals. I didn't even see that. Jesus. Okay. So you don't actually have to play 200. You have to play 250 matches. I get, I get it's quite cool. Okay. It's quite cool because it's an objective you can do throughout the, the course of FIFA. You know, up until the end of end of time and the end of FIFA 23, you can still be playing this and, and completing your silver objective, which is very cool. Okay. Give them credit for that. It's very cool. Um... So I can't really knock on that too much. It's just a lot, isn't it? It's just a lot. It's a lot to do. But yeah, subjectives you can do over, over a long period of time and not something you can probably do quite quickly, which I think everybody wants to do. And maybe that's the problem. Maybe that's my mentality of wanting to do everything instantly and, and get the immediate rewards. But uh, yeah, so all that aside, it's quite cool, I suppose, for the longevity. But overall, it's a bit much. It's a bit much for silvers. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. That is pretty much it. We're going to end on this somewhat garbage pack. Who knows? We could get an icon. We could get anything out of this. We could get anything. We could get like a 79 rated rare, which is very cool. You do love to see it. There's a boards though. Mocking aside, that's not bad. Argentina. Right wing. Barcelona. Lionel Messi. Ooh, who cares? Okay, Venega. Cool. Oh, we get Lacazette as well. Yo, Lacazette. Best player in the Prem. Highest goal scorer. Shiniest head of them all. Let's go. Big up. And Bellarabi. So that's actually not a bad pack in fairness. 283s and 182. Origi, Lacazette. You do love to see it. You do love to see it. But uh, there we go. So that is the end of today's video. Obviously, new outro screen. It's still work in progress. It's not... It's not fully there, but uh, it's looking pretty nice so far. Obviously, you've got all the socials on the side. So if you want to check anything out on Twitter, like I said last time or in the last video, if you if you watched it or not, um, a lot of the pack pools that I don't show on video or in videos, they go up on there. So if you do want to check them out, um, some spicy pools will be put up on there as soon as they are. And I will try and start using Instagram as well. Just set that up. So that's, that's new. If you do want to jump over and follow us on there that's uh, very very cool and of course hit that subscribe button and become part of the exclusive family but also if you like the video do drop it a like that'd be very very much appreciated um yeah i, I would really really appreciate it but uh, with that said i do hope you enjoyed thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time till tomorrow who's going to be overpriced spc day of the week number eight who knows who cares